Hallelujah. It is a massive convocation in Lagos. Sons of Zion. Sons of Zion, the youth of a generation. We cry for something higher. Listen. Something will happen here. First of all, I want to celebrate all the men of God, the people that are served. Amen. I understand that there are many ministers hidden in the congregation. Maurice is my brother, Samuel. And many other people that I might not be able to identify you now. But the Lord knows where you are. Now, we have to leave the garment of who we are in the natural. Everyone will have to seek the king in the spirit. Brothers and sisters, it's better we are small physically and big in God. You know what I found out? A generation is not looking for more pastors. They are looking for God carriers. I know you have prayed. <laughs> I know you have prayed. I see some people. The way I'm looking at some people, they are now resting. They are resting. This is not what it takes to bring redemption to a generation. Do you know Elijah, that mighty man, after eating the first one, the angel called him and said, Elijah, come. Come eat, eat again. For the journey is what? No, he didn't say the journey is far. He said the journey is great. It's not the same thing. If he's far, it's about distance. If he's great, it means that strength is involved, wisdom is involved, power is involved, energy is involved. He's great. Elijah have seen fire, but the journey to Horeb, the Mount of Encounter. Whenever you hear Horeb, then there is a transition in the spirit. God is about to elect young men to marshal gates in this nation, to marshal gates in Africa. Now, the problem is that it's not by witches. If it's by witches, everybody will be there. What we need to is to separate ourselves. The Bible said, a man, um, by through desire, separates himself. Desire separates also. Hunger, desire. Desperation. I was in a meeting like this, but it's a pastor's meeting many years ago. <laughs> After we prayed from 10 till 4 in the morning, I wanted to rest. I was so tired. When I wanted to rest, I felt somebody tap me. He said, Give me two more hours. You see, actually, you can you are free to go now. But we prayed, we have been praying for long before we came for this program. And God showed us what he wants to do in the land and in the territory. Uh, we are much here. All I need is 70 people. 70 brutal men. That we cry, my vessel is large. I can carry it. I can carry it. <laughs> we are going to pray for just five more minutes. Huh? you will find a neighbor I believe you have prayed long enough wait, not yet you have prayed long enough you know people that are not serious here some of them are hanging around don't mind them they will, come, they will come and ask you for help everybody must not be great it's by choice it's by choice your prayer is simple John chapter 16 verse 12. How I wish we have projection. Okay. John chapter 16 verse 12. John 16 verse 12. 
I feel a garment from heaven now. You don't need to believe it. Oh. I have passed the level of trying to make people believe. Lagos, are you ready? Are you sure you can carry what is happening? You are not. No, you are not. See, listen, you are not. You are not. Believe me, you are not. How many of you know how to steward realities in the spirit? How many of you can do Naivij 3 hours, 12 to 3, every day for 21 days, no break, non-stop? It's not you want. I'm not saying you want. I'm saying you can now. How many of you will decide that you will not put food in your mouth in this year end? Yes. You wake up in the morning, 6 to 6, 6 to 3, 6 to 12 till the year end. No, it's not prayer for anything to happen. It's prayer that I'm tired of this level. It increase my capacity. Our tent is little. from money the spirit of prayer will come i came to lagos many years ago 2017 i held i held a two days prayer meeting where is daniel amobi he was he was in their church i came when we finished the program a young man said i'm struggling with my prayer life i came i said come here he came i hugged him he went back and prayed for 10 hours non-stop see let me tell you prayer there is a spirit even if you want to stop you can't Your mouth and your womb will be making their own motion. Come on, 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 come One minute. Fuck! 
Jesus said, listen. I pray not I that pray. I pray hear not I that pray. Simbas, there is a praying spirit within me. Listen. Look at this scripture. You will find a neighbor. <laughs> Can you see this scripture? Listen, the Bible said, I have yet many things to say unto you. Can you see that text? He said, I have many things to say unto you. He said, But ye cannot bear them. And I began to ask questions. How can God be saying something instead of hearing you are bearing? That means the, the communications of God is not to tickle your fancy. It's not to give you new information. It's a communication of reality. The Bible said that the words I speak to you, their spirit and their life. So Jesus is saying your capacity to trap divine realities is small. I want to give you more, but you cannot carry it. What you have is what you decided to have. Don't blame anybody. Don't say, eh, God. no, no. What you have is what you chose to have. Men that want to have more, they hold the gates of heaven and, and, and become brutal. They do violence on heaven. Do you know what the Bible said? The Bible said, since the day of John the Baptist, the kingdom suffers violence. <laughs> Listen to me. Listen. Listen. Listen, many things are happening already. But we'll get to that one. We'll get to that one later. I saw somebody now that is presented to a shrine but if you will pray so you are seeking God or you are not praying for deliverance many things will fall off some of you the reason why you have not made progress in life and in God is the yokes of darkness that has bound you your foundations are stronger than you <laughs> it's because you have not lashed on to energy divine I know I know I know I know a power listen to what you are going to do and we are going to pray for five minutes just five how many minutes how many minutes I went to somebody one day listen I told somebody who pray two minutes and we ended up praying two hours and the person said uh -uh, is this your two minutes I said, it seems as if you have not been reading your Bible. If God said that Jesus is coming soon, you need to go to heaven and ask them to interpret the meaning of soon. Because you would have realized that since 2,000 years ago, it is still soon. And it is still valid. Your Bible said that a thousand years is like what? You are now with me. So when I say two minutes, you can do the mass. Why are you why are you in a hurry to end prayer? For you to go back the same, continue the way you are. Are you not tired? I'm tired. That's what they told me those years ago. Many years ago, I came to do job interview here in Lagos. I passed the final stage. They were supposed to call me to come and start work. This is happening around 2015. I now lost my phone. God now asked me, don't you know that this thing you are doing is a prison yard? 
an average person in Lagos is in a pre- he's free or he's having money but you are in prison you will look at what God told you when you were in campus he died in Lagos you see what will happen here men will gain ventilation in the spirit many of the ordination gifts anointing calling prophecies there will be heavy activation let me tell you let me tell you how activation works it's not just impartation there is a certain energy that have the capacity to power different dimensions of your life so if we don't ascend to that energy level you will just be hearing it you'll be seeing it but you will not touch it that's what god told john he said come up Peter." the experiences i want to bring you into is not something don't co- come as you are don't stay there if we give it to you some of them will kill you i have many things to show you sister can you carry it can you carry it i came to a meeting many years ago 2018 in that meeting a young man came and told me give me everything you have 2018 that was long ago i told you i told god just give him a little bit of what you gave me no you are not the one just give him a little bit of what he gave me be careful the prayer you pray when i now say god give me a little bit the young man almost died make sure this one is not dead the young man almost died the reason is because i said a little he was doing like this i wanted i said god reduce it more reduce and as good as that prayer is so relieve the man of the moment i'm not happy i'm not happy that we don't have heavy men heavy in the spirit conduits of eternal matters wait in their members fasting and prayer has made them as slim as me but when you encounter them in the spirit huh, you will never be the same they are they are territorial commanders a young lady she's just 21 huh? but when she stands in her family she will stand at the gate and say deborah the wife of lapid prophetess church in israel do you know what the bible spoke about deborah he said when men escaped he said i deborah stood a church in israel because as of that moment nobody is rising in your family and the only body that he, any, the only person seeing the problem is that young lady of 20 years 21 and god is saying can you yield me your womb give me womb give me space within you some of you will leave this meeting and pray like that six hours in the night in the day everywhere you are going you are praying listen as you are praying as you are doing all kinds of things will be happening there is a realm that god brought me and he showed me sir there is a man called renard bonk he has died there is a dimension one of the dimension he has when renard bonk is ministry no matter the crowd his spirit covers everywhere and the team manifests like a dove a bird over the meeting that bed we hang over this meeting listen to me whether wherever you are even the people following us online there is no distance you do you have capacity like this like this you are <laughs> you know what we are going to do look at this you will ask god this is scriptural god said i have many things to communicate to you but you lack bearing capacity your prayer is simple in the next five minutes give me the bearing capacity for for what you are about to give me to sell and service a generation with a simple prayer find a neighbor for 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 obey my instruction now listen now let me tell you huh? pray until because when you join hands angels will join hands with you whether you are seeing them or not doesn't matter pray until you have your own encounter as you are for there make sure that you need that you need draws down god from heaven are you with me now are you ready somebody pray for five minutes Da 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 da
Hallelujah. Pow, pow. Prayer power, prayer power, prayer power, prayer power, prayer power. From where you need another, when you pray, the spirit of prayer will descend. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes. So, somebody pray There is a praying spirit within me. Oh, symbols, symbols. <laughs> Lagos, bro. There is a sound of revival, Lagos. for now. Simbas only. Swat. Abebebe. Abebebe. What? God we pray. Kao. 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 Let your womb open. God we pray. Pray. God we. Abebebe. Abebebe. Give me bearing capacity. Give me bearing capacity. Oh my God. Oh my God. 